What's up guys, I woke up really late today, probably like 1.20 p.m. So I just started crushing water. I've already had two of these on my third one. I'm just trying to get really super hydrated and I gotta catch up on my meals as well because it's already freaking 1.30 or something. But I got this shake right here, meal one. And also, I just saw, I gotta be on the week package right here. So let's open that up for you guys. <laughs> Alright guys, finally got this package open. I was trying to open it with a pen before, but that didn't work too well, so use the handy dandy scissors. Whoa, let's see what we got. Look at that Beyond the Week mug. Honestly guys, that's a sick mug. And we're gonna put it to use right away. You know what I like about it? This handle. You know when you get those mugs, they have those small ass handles? I'm a fan. Let's get this thing filled up with some good stuff. This will fit a triple cappuccino for sure. All right, I told you this would fit a triple cappuccino. We actually got hella room to spare, so I could probably get four in there. But three is good enough for me. Thanks beyond the week. A solid mug right here. So I know I show you guys my meals a lot, but I think it's good that you get a good idea of what I'm eating since I am eating a little bit differently now. Basically six clean meals a day, carbs around training, fats to just get in good daily healthy fats on meals that I don't have carbs, and uh, check this one out. This will be my pre-workout meal, sweet potato, and I sweetened this with Splenda, cinnamon, and a little bit of sugar-free syrup. None of that is counted or tracked, we're not worrying about it. Egg white omelet with greens and Mrs. Dash, and this is like a typical meal um, for carbs, protein, and veggies. Gonna enjoy this, watch some Rich Piana, and uh, probably lift. It's snowing outside, by the way. Haven't showed you guys this, but I'll probably lift in about hour or so. Let this digest. Check this out, though. You see that? Epic snow. Sickening winter time. So remember how yesterday I said I couldn't get the lights off this uh, artificial Christmas tree? Well, actually, the lights don't come off. What actually happens is you just take the tree apart and then you put it in this box. So let's do that. Hurry up, Riley, I know you're cold. boy. <laughs> All right, Riley, come on. Inside. Good boy. In you go. In you go. Oh, you need water. Let's get you know what time it is. Time for some cotton candy. Hide cotton candy, guys, by far. My favorite pre-workout. I'm gonna have to go right now, of all time. All right, guys, just got in my car. And as you can see, the side windows are covered in snow. That's what my windshield wiper looked like before I just did this. So it's pretty funny. Let me see. I still got the fluid. It's not frozen or anything, so that's good. Look at that snow. Shout out to all the West Coasters, Southeast Coasters, not experiencing this. It's glorious. What's going on guys? Bringing you this voiceover from today's delts and traps workout, which went very well. Just finished up meal five and I still got meal six. Probably try to head to bed a little bit earlier than last night since as you see in the video, I woke up very late. But as you see, dumbbell pressing right here. And uh, these went really, really well. Surprisingly well, actually. I was able to hit the 80 pounders for a set of 10. And then on this second set you're seeing, I only got seven. And then I rested a little bit and I was able to get 10 again. And I'm usually only able to do the 70s for a little bit of reps when I'm bulking. So I'm really happy about how those 80s felt. I don't know how my shoulders are as strong or just a little less strong than some of my dumbbell chest pressing, but that's just kind of how it works sometimes. I'm hitting the barbell right here, and I'm gonna superset this with some lateral raises. Now, 
the reason, another reason why I was so happy with my workout was because after PRing basically on all those dumbbell sets, I was hitting the barbell press for what I would normally hit in my bulk after already being pre-exhausted and supersetting. So my shoulders are definitely hanging in there. They're getting stronger. And with the right kind of diet is what I kind of want to urge here. Um, you can make progress in both directions, at least semi simultaneously. Now, this is going to be the last movement um, for this video as far as workout clips go. However, I did hit rear delts, traps, and cardio as well. And as you see in the next clip, I'm going to talk about how I felt post cardio. It was uh, pretty odd, hard to explain, but that was the workout, guys. I hope you enjoyed it. Like this video. I'll see you in the next one. Enjoy the rest. Peace out. Just finished up post workout cardio. <clears throat> I can like barely walk right now. And it's not even cause I'm like fatigued from my lift. I just have this like really weird physical sensation like going on in my body right now. That's like post workout cardio high. It's really weird. Beyond the weak Cody by the way, but yeah. feels fucking weird it's like painful yet a pleasure simultaneously can't find my car all right let's go home and get this shake post where I got shake about to go down I just got this fudge brownie in the mail from my order on bodybuilding.com so I'm pretty psyched to try this out I also got my dextro so we're gonna be using this for 50 carbs so I'm not exactly positive <clears throat> what accounted for all for that like weird feeling. It's sort of fading out now, but it's still very odd. But I do know I need calories in me really badly as soon as I'm done with my post-workout cardio. And this is the shake right here. This is the fudge brownie diametized with dextrose. Really, really good right here. Um, oh shit, actually, I was supposed to put a little bit more protein in there. I'm probably gonna go fix that. But yeah, that's a really good shake. It's a shake that I'm most likely going to be bringing with me um, to the gym from now on so I can get it in ASAP. But I'm probably going to end the video here and get it edited up for you guys. So if you enjoyed it, make sure you drop it a like. Stay tuned for the future. Get more content out to you guys. And subscribe if you haven't already. Comment below like you guys always do. I will see you in the next one. Peace out.